Man United could get £15 million transfer boost from West Ham, despite Jean-Claire Todibo agreement. United had been linked with a move for Todibo, but West Ham could them a favor despite agreeing a deal for the Frenchman. West Ham United could be about to hand Manchester United a major transfer boost, despite the Hammers reaching an agreement to sign former target Jean-Claire Todibo. Todibo had been linked with a move to Old Trafford this summer, but UEFA's multi-ownership rules blocked them making a move for the Nice defender, as the French club are also owned by Ineos. Interest in the France international is high, though, and despite it looking like he was going to join Juventus, West Ham have agreed a deal with Nice to sign the 24-year-old. The Hammers have struck an initial loan deal with an option to sign Todibo for £27 million next summer, and it is now up to the player to decide whether he wants to move to East London. West Ham are looking to reshape their defense under new manager Julian Lopetegui, and have already signed Max Kilman from Wolverhampton Wanderers for £40 million. And as part of that reshuffle, the Telegraph report they are keen to sign Manchester United right-back Aaron Wan-Bissaka this summer. The 26-year-old is out of contract next summer, and this transfer window represents the last chance United have to recoup a significant fee for a player they paid £40 million to sign from Crystal Palace five years ago. Reports suggest West Ham want to strike a £15 million deal for Juan Bissaka, and while that would represent a significant loss on the fee they paid to sign him, any player sales will go towards United's own rebuild this summer. Eric Ten Hag's side have already secured the £36 million signing of Joshua Xerxy from Bologna, while they are expected to seal a £58.7 million deal for Lille defender Lenny Yoro. As such, they will need to trade players in order to bring in some more signings this summer, with the likes of Matthijs De Ligt, Jared Branthwaite, and Manuel Ugarte linked with moves to Old Trafford. Any money they receive for the likes of Juan Bissaka, Mason Greenwood, Victor Lindelof, and possibly even Scott McTominay would fund moves for Ten Hag to give his side a major refresh in the summer transfer window. Manchester United finds itself in an intriguing position as it navigates the summer transfer window. The club is reportedly on the verge of securing a £15 million financial boost from West Ham United a development that could significantly impact their transfer strategy, even with an agreement already in place for French defender Jean-Claire Todibo. United has been in negotiations for Todibo, a talented centre-back currently playing for Nice in League One. The 23-year-old has been a standout performer in the French League, attracting attention from several top clubs. Sources suggest that United's management believes Todibo's potential and versatility make him an ideal fit for their defensive line. While terms have been discussed, the completion of the transfer hinges on additional financial maneuvering. West Ham, looking to bolster their squad after a promising season, has shown interest in several Manchester United players. Reports indicate that the Hammers are keen on securing a deal for a United player, which could result in a cash injection for the Red Devils. This situation presents an opportunity for United to not only offload a player who may not fit into Eric Ten Hag's plans, but also to secure funds that could be reinvested into their own squad. If West Ham follows through with a significant purchase from United, it could provide a much-needed £15 million boost. This influx of cash could facilitate the completion of the Todibo deal and potentially allow United to pursue additional targets. The financial flexibility gained from this transaction could be pivotal as the club aims to strengthen its defense and other key areas of the team. The possible transfer of a player to West Ham opens up various scenarios for United. Depending on which player is involved, it could free up wages and provide the necessary funds to enhance their summer spending. The club has been under pressure to make strategic signings that align with Ten Hag's vision, and this situation could be a turning point in their transfer dealings. As the transfer window heats up, Manchester United is poised to navigate a complex web of negotiations. The potential £15 million boost from West Ham could be crucial in finalizing their agreement with Jean-Claire Todibo and addressing other pressing needs within the squad. 
Fans will be watching closely as the situation develops, eager to see how these strategic moves will shape the team's future. Meanwhile, in other news, additionally on a related note, furthermore, Man United deal will worry Virgil van Dijk and Man City star as talks advance. Manchester United transfer target Matthijs de Ligt, who played under Eric Ten Hag at Ajax, has previously been lauded by two of his international teammates. Manchester United will have Virgil van Dijk and Nathan Ake concerned if they can snare one of their top targets this summer. United are looking to strengthen in numerous areas during the first closed season with Sir Jim Ratcliffe in charge of football operations. Centre-back is a key priority and talks are believed to be underway over signing Bayern Munich defender Matthijs de Ligt, who played under Eric Ten Hag at Ajax. Sky Sports Germany report that Ten Hag is still a big fan of the 24-year-old who joined Bayern from Juventus for around $68 million two years ago, and that talks are advancing. Juve, in turn, paid a similar amount to Ajax in the summer of 2019. The Bavarian giants are said to be willing to sell for the right price. De Ligt, currently with the Netherlands at Euro 2024, is highly rated by his Premier League-based teammates. As far back as 2019, when he was linked with Liverpool, he was touted as a star of the future by Van Dijk, who said, He's obviously an excellent defender, that's clear. He can still improve a lot and he realizes that, but playing like he does at that age is fantastic and I'm really happy to play beside him for the Netherlands. More recently, Ake has sung De Ligt's praises. The Manchester City defender compared him to Van Dyke, telling Goal, De Ligt is still so young but he has played so many games in top flight football and for the Dutch national team. It's amazing what he is doing at the moment. Everyone has full confidence in him. As you can see, he's a great player. He's quick, strong for his age, very good in the air, and on the ball, he is very good. He scores so many from set pieces, so he's got a lot of the same attributes as Van Dyke. If United do manage to sign De Ligt, who is yet to appear at Euro 2024 with Ronald Koeman preferring a centre-back partnership of Van Dyke and Stefan de Vrij, then Van Dyke and Aka will know the quality of player United will be getting. Despite his lack of appearances in Germany, the 24-year-old is still widely considered a top central defender in Europe and made 30 appearances for Bayern Munich last season, despite suffering several injuries. As well as the Holland International, United are also said to be looking to strike deals for Manuel Ugarte, Joshua Zerkzi, and Gerard Braithwaite this summer. The reported advancements in Manchester United's deal have sparked concern among rivals, notably catching the attention of Virgil van Dijk from Liverpool and a star player at Manchester City. Speculation and rumours abound as talks progress, hinting at significant moves that could potentially reshape the competitive landscape of English football. For Virgil van Dijk, a stalwart in Liverpool's defence and a pivotal figure in their recent successes, the prospect of Manchester United strengthening their squad raises eyebrows. Known for his commanding presence and defensive prowess, Van Dyke recognizes the potential implications of United bolstering their lineup with key acquisitions. The rivalry between Liverpool and Manchester United adds further intrigue, with each move in the transfer market scrutinized for its potential impact on the balance of power in the Premier League. Meanwhile, the unnamed Manchester City star also finds reason to monitor developments closely. As part of a squad renowned for its depth and quality across all positions, any strategic moves by United could prompt strategic responses from their crosstown rivals. The competitive nature of Manchester City's pursuit of domestic and European glory demands constant assessment of rivals' activities ensuring they remain poised to maintain their standing at the pinnacle of English football. Amidst the speculation, negotiations, and strategic maneuvering, the footballing world eagerly awaits official announcements and concrete developments. The ripple effects of Manchester United's potential deals extend beyond the clubs directly involved, influencing tactical planning, squad dynamics, and aspirations for the upcoming season. As discussions evolve and decisions near completion, the landscape of English football stands on the brink of change, 
with players and fans alike anticipating the impact of these pivotal developments. If Manchester United manages to secure one of their top targets this summer, it could indeed raise concerns among defenders like Virgil van Dijk of Liverpool and Nathan Ake of Manchester City. The potential acquisition would signify United's intent to strengthen their squad significantly, potentially posing a greater challenge to their rivals in the upcoming season.